The clarity was that we had nothing until we were given powers. And the Constitution made it so clear that was the case, we could not accept it. Erasmus was confident of his position. When First. he spoke, every Indian and Métis in the room stood supporting him. The treaties should be implemented for the mutual benefit of the signatories. Not just Canada should benefit from the natural resources on our traditional lands. The way out of poverty for us is for the full implementation of our treaties. But a time must come to question the way things are done. Time to allow for the people that are affected to adapt to those changes. A time for the land to heal. A time to question the business as usual approach. This day testifies to nothing less than the achievement of the impossible. For the generations that will follow us, we bear witness today in this house that our survival as First Nations peoples in this land is affirmed forever. So if education was a tool of oppression, if it was a tool that held our people down, then I ask all of you today, not just those gathered here, but all Canada, shouldn't education be a tool of freedom for our people? Reconnect us with our language, with our character.